Explorer Henry Worsley dies in Antarctic crossing. Explorer Henry Worsley has died after suffering exhaustion and dehydration during an attempt to cross Antarctica. The former army officer, 55, was 71 days into his bid to become the first person to cross the continent unaided. In a statement, his wife Joanna said she felt heartbroken sadness. Mr. Worsley, from Fulham in London, died of complete organ failure, she added. The Duke of Cambridge said he was very sad to hear of Mr. Worsley's death, while David Beckham also paid tribute. He was a man who showed great courage and determination and we are incredibly proud to be associated with him, the Duke said. On Instagram, Beckham said he was lucky to have met Henry, who served our country for so many years. 30 miles short. The remark group, which was supporting Mr. Worsley's effort, said he was 30 miles short of his ultimate goal. When Henry was picked up by Antarctic Logistics and Expeditions, Ale, he was suffering from exhaustion and dehydration the group said in a statement. He was flown to a hospital in Puta Arenas, in Chile, where he was found to have bacterial peritonitis. This resulted in Henry undergoing surgery but in spite of all the efforts of Ail and medical staff, he succumbed. Mr. Worsley began the 1,100 mile, 1,770 kilometers coast-to-coast -coast trek in November, pulling a sledge containing his food, tent and equipment. The plan was to cross the continent unassisted and unsupported with no supply drops or help from dogs or any other source. He had passed his target of raising £100,000 for the Endeavour Fund, which helps injured and sick servicemen and women. In a statement, the fund said it was devastated by news of Mr. Worsley's death. Drive for Soldiers In October he told the BBC he expected to lose 2 stone, 12.7 kilograms, during the challenge. He said his journey should take 75 days and he would take enough food for 80 days, add in, I could make it last a bit longer. Asked if he was mad to take on the challenge, he said, there is no black art to sliding one ski in front of the other. What will drive me on is raising money for these wounded soldiers.